sure many of you have seen this. Many of you, you know, probably, you know, do it yourself. And what happens and what we see frequently is just this over preparation with the idea we're going to get something done. And we might have quote, quote, say for marketing and we prepare and prepare and prepare and the traffic flow never gets there because we spend all of our time in preparation, not in doing. Same thing in making outbound calls and, and uh, you know, getting uh, referrals off the workout floor. You know, we procrastinate doing that and many other things, calling people back, you know, doing follow up. It's, it's all over. And so we want to talk about this today. And the first thing I want to talk about is don't be afraid of taking risk. You know, nothing is ever going to be accomplished without some risk taking in there. And some of this risk taking, I mean, it's pretty simple things. Uh, you, can, no, you can't have fear of being rejected. You can't have fear of, of, of criticism because the reality is, and something you want to accept, this is going to happen. It is absolutely part of the process. Okay. If you don't have those things, trust me, you're not pushing hard enough. So you're going to make mistakes when you do this. It's going to happen. Sometimes we have fear of making that mistake and don't. It's going to happen. It's part of the process as well. I'd rather see you make the mistake because you're too aggressive, because you're pushing as opposed to being too passive. If you're being too passive, nothing good's going to come from that. You're waiting for it to all come to you and it won't. Go out and get it. Okay. Fear of rejection. You know, we mentioned this and the big thing about fear of rejection, the thing that we see is what it ends up being. It's more of a realization that you have nothing else in your pipeline. You know, folks that really have this high level of, of, of fear of rejection, they have no, no one else to call, no one else to follow up on. There's no one else to talk to in a sense. Whereas those that have, you know, multiple uh, uh, streams of, of leads and multiple streams of, of things they're working on that their pipeline is full, they don't seem to have that same fear of rejection because as soon as that one's done, they move on to the next one. Now, one of the great, uh, one of the great quotes you can use to identify some of this because, you know, procrastination so often, it, it's tied into really making excuses. And the reality is you can make money either as a business owner or as a salesperson. You can choose to make money or you can choose to make excuses. You can choose to procrastinate, but you can't do both. And the best way to handle this, the best way to look at this, you know, get your strategy together on this, but have this attitude, give it to me, I'll handle it, I'll get it done now. You know, call that person back now, follow up now, okay? Scratch things off that to-do list that you have for that day, get it done today, okay? My name is Jim Thomas, and this has been the Fitness Management Update.